A group of 17 people in a study on lung cancer consists of three heavy smokers, four light smokers, and 10 non-smokers. Six people from the group are chosen at random. Calculate the probability that three of the chosen ones are non-smokers. So since we only want the probability that three are non-smokers, although they give us three groups here, the heavy smokers, light smokers, and non-smokers, but we can actually reduce it to two groups because since uh, the probability that we need only involves the non-smokers, so basically the two groups that we can have are the non-smokers and the non-non-smokers. And the non-non-smokers will basically consist of both the types of smokers, whether they are heavy smokers or light smokers. So we have 17 people total. And of them, we have 10 non-smokers, which means there are seven smokers. So that's basically our grouping, that 10 non-smokers and seven smokers out of the 17 people. And we want the probability of choosing three non-smokers if we select six from this 17. So this is the basic hypergeometric situation where if we have a total of n items and a are of type a and b are of type b, then the probability of selecting little n items, uh, which six are of type a is given by this formula. And in this case, n is the total number of people in the study, the big n and the small n is the sample that we selected. We selected six of them. And a, little a, is 10, which is the total number of non-smokers, and little b is seven, which is the number of smokers out of the 17 present in the study. And we want the probability of three non-smokers to be selected out of six. So by hypergeometric, we have three non-smokers out of the 10 non-smokers. That's mm, possible in 10 C3 ways. And uh, that means since there are a total of six in the sample, so mm, there will be six minus three smokers out of the seven smokers. So that happens in seven combination six minus three ways. And we divide it by 17 combination six because we are selecting a sample of six from a total of 17 available. And this gives us 0.339, that is choice D.